Supporters of the ban gathered outside City Hall ahead of the council meeting. They say big tobacco companies are increasingly using candy-like flavors to get youth hooked on nicotine in hopes that they'll grow into lifelong smokers and vapors. We know the long-term effect of nicotine use in smoking, and it is imperative that San Diego act now to try and break that cycle once again. This ordinance will help stop the rising rates of adolescent addiction in the city of San Diego, and I'm proud to bring it forward. Smoke and vape shop owners turned out in force to oppose the ban, saying it would result in lost jobs and tax revenue, and that the issue should be decided at the state level. Many said youth rarely get flavored tobacco products from brick-and-mortar stores. They're getting it from online sources, unregulated and untaxed black market, social media, the city's ban will take effect next January. California voters will decide in November whether to ban the sale of flavored tobacco statewide. Andrew Bowen, KPBS News.